What up? What's good? What's poppin'? Ni hao. Wago. And it's your boy Lynx and welcome back. Today we're gonna check out the Air Max 1 Chinatown NYC 2020. Let's get it. Alright, so let's start with the box. Nothing special here. Standard Nike box. Air Max 1, Nike Air Max 1 SE. Yes, this is my size, 10 and a half. Let's take them out of the box and check it out. <coughs> Woo! Wow, yeah, these are pretty. So, I haven't even got to look at them really good. I took them out of the box once, haven't even put them on yet. So let's go do it together. Basically the same, same detailing on both feet. So let's start with the, with the textures and then we can move on to the other details. So we got suede accents, suede on the toe bug on the upper, black suede. Um, we have black patent leather on the back. We have this, I don't know, it's shiny, synthetic material. It's, it's really, I don't know what, what you compare this to. I've seen like dresses, maybe like, oh, you know what? The Chinese shirts and pants, the outfits, I don't know what they call them. A lot of them would be in this material. I'm just realizing that. So it has this like shiny threading, pink and I don't know, reddish pink color and tone to it. Um, so that's on the toe box here. It's also in the back of the heel, uh, from the side to the back. It's really cool. We have some more patent leather accents up in the front. That pink coral color. Um, we have a canvas material here around the, the eyelid. We have a little more of that canvas material in the tongue. And then behind the tongue is like a soft, soft suede maybe. Um, a lot of big stitching around the Nike check on the sides. And then you have this plastic material that makes up the Nike check. We also have um, more stitching on the back here with the horse with wings that's stitched and braided into the patent leather. So that's cool. So um, as far as colors, I said it's a lot of black suede, black patent leather, that pink coral color up in the front. We got yellow on the tongue, um, white on the midsole. On the outsole, we have that coral color. We got like a lighter pink on the front here. Towards the back, middle, yellow. And then at, way at the back on the heel is blue. I like that, that's really cool. The same thing on both feet. Yes, same thing. Um, some details. We got a little Nike check stitch here with that coral pink and yellow. We got um, two different pink tones stitched into the black um, in the toe box and in, and in the back. Well actually it goes around the side also. It's not a, it doesn't go all the way around on the inside. It goes around the side on the, on the outside. Um, yellow stitching here on the patent leather. Like I said that coral pink stitching here with another blue stitching on the Nike check. We also have some blue on the inside of the of the sneaker. The laces, black with, with highlights, coral highlights, and pink lace tips. That's cool. Don't forget about the rubber Nike check, the rubber um, Nike hang tag. That is nice. So yes, yeah, a lot of nice little details here, even in the. In the air bubble, 
we have that coral pink going all the way through. It's real nice. Down inside, we have um, black with what looks like some pink and yellow circles. I don't know if they're supposed to represent like um, lanterns, you know, like the Chinese lanterns. At least that's what I think. Who knows? On the tongue, we have a black tag with a coral Nike check and some Chinese characters, two Chinese characters, yellow with, um, with the coral stitching around it. Not sure what that means. I've heard one person say that says Nike, but um, I can't confirm that. Anyone, you can leave a comment down below and let me know if you know what it means. Um, let me know if you know what it means before and or if you can read that, you can translate it. That'd be appreciated. We got in the eyelets is yellow, so we got pink, the coral with the pink stitching, and then a, a, a hard yellow plastic in the eyelet. Um, I think that's it as far as details. It's a pretty dope sneaker. I really like it. So this sneaker is in commemoration of Chinese New Year, the year of the rat, and um, this represents. New York's Chinatown. I guess you can um, see a lot of colors when you go into when you go into Chinatown. It's known for you know the, all the stores and the awnings. You know they they're, they're very colorful, very lots of lots of details. So yeah, let me know what you think about these sneakers. Did you get them? Did you try to get them? Do you like them? Would you get them? What do you like about them? What don't you like? Leave a comment down below and let me know. Um, don't forget, like, subscribe, and um, yeah, check out my other videos. If you missed the, the last video I did, it was a culmination of sneakers that I, I caught in the late, late last year. And um, I put them all together in one video, so check that out. I'll put the link here or at the end of the video, actually. You can just click the link to check that out. Yeah, so stay tuned for that on foot footage and check that out now. So until next time, Titan. Yeah, man, I like sneakers like this. As um, even though they have a lot of colors, very interesting looking sneaker. I find these are the type of sneakers you can just wear anything with. You can match them up, and you can get colors that go with it, and that's all dope. But you can literally just throw on a pair of jeans, black jeans, blue jeans. Choose your your color and shirt. Because there's so many options. Just just rock it. White t-shirt works.